guys and welcome to my channel. Today in my very first video we are going to talk about scrapbooking. So what is scrapbooking? <laughs> Don't worry guys I am not going to bore you with a big definition or something but let's talk about it. A scrapbook is a collection of memories. Scrap basically means a piece of something that you don't need anymore like movie tickets, airport, boarding class parcels and even this little piece of color paper. I can't use it anywhere else but I can creatively use this in my scrapbook. Now in a scrapbook we collect all these memories and make it into a keepsake journal. So like after 5 or 10 years when we turn the pages of our lovely scrapbook we get to revisit those good old days in our memory. So, why this video? I mean there are obviously thousands of other videos available on the internet. Why this one? When I got started with scrapbooking, I searched for a lot of videos on YouTube. But most of them were from foreign YouTubers. The supplies that they use are not easily available here in India and even if they are, it's, they are very costly. There are a few videos from Indian YouTubers as well, but they look something like this. <laughs> Even if I tried for a lifetime, I won't be able to recreate something like this. Not everybody is good with art and craft or painting, calligraphy, etc. So in this video series, I'll share some basic ideas to create a lovely scrapbook easily and within a budget. Now let's talk supplies. I get mine at a local stationery. It is cheapest way to get everything and you get to see the products beforehand, which is not possible while shopping online. Now, when I searched online for a scrapbook, I found quite a few on Amazon. They ranged between 200 to 300 and were very attractive. But when I looked for the product description, it was much smaller in size and there were only 20 pages in it. So for a tiny 20 page scrapbook, 250 rupees sounds a lot and don't forget the shipping price. So the total will go about 300 rupees. Be careful if you decide to shop online and always read the description, not only for scrapbook but for anything that you are buying. So according to me, getting a scrapbook online is not budget friendly. Second option is to get it from a local stationery. Now you may not find a typical scrapbook but there are other options. Like for example this one. This is an A4 size sketchbook. It has 100 pages and is of 100 rupees. It is white throughout but you can always paint the pages or stick a color paper on it to make it more beautiful. Now third option is to take a bunch of color paper. It's up to you if you want to take a single color or a mix of colors but take a Take a stack, put a cardboard on front and back. Now you can also use hard paper instead of cardboard and bind them. You can you can you can sew the pages or punch them and even put a ribbon through it, but I suggest you to bind the papers because they last much longer and won't come off easily. Now apart from these basic needs always keep a black pan in hand now this is probably the most used thing in my scrapbook because whenever I don't have any idea I just doodle something with a black pen and it always look beautiful you also need a glue I usually use a favorite stick but since it was not available I got this one it's, it's not not that sticky but yeah it does the work you will also need a cutter a part, uh, scissors cut the pages but if you want to cut something like straight the cutter is cutter always comes in handy now for decoration I like to use these glitter tapes now these are very elegant you can border the pages or even make some designs out of it there are also these ones um, they are cheaper and like more longer than these ones I think these are about 10 rupees each and yeah they are they, they make the page look very attractive now you can also use washi tape um, I didn't find any at my stationery but you can find it online I think it was about 450 rupees for 20 
pieces of tape they are very beautiful and look amazing on a scrapbook so i also use these stickers now they may look a little childish but trust me when you put them on the scrapbook they look beautiful they also help in filling up the page like if you have an empty spot left don't leave it blank just put a sticker on it and what i like about this is that they are thick so when you put them on a paper they will the paper will lift making your scrapbook look heavy these were only five rupees per packet and yeah they're lovely colorful and your scrapbook will look more attractive if you put stickers on it you can also find plain stickers but yeah i love these now let's get started with the, with the scrapbook so a quick backstory when the, before the pandemic started my mom went to goa with her friends and uh, she enjoyed a lot and it was an adventurous trip for her so i decided to make a scrapbook and give it gift it to her so she, i bet she loved this idea and she gets to keep her memories forever in a scrapbook so let's get started with the front page now the key to making a front page is to keep it as simple as you can don't overfill your front page so here you can see i cut out strips of light blue dark blue and black paper and stuck one over the other and i also um, put some stickers to make the page look more full full and not full and since it was looking blank i decided to put a border now the, these you can see i put it in a wave style now goa is all about beaches and ocean sea so i went with this blue theme now if you want you can also use some like sun sun setting types theme like um uh, black orange and then yellow or you can make any combination of your own now i put the date 10th november to 15th november so whenever you open the front page you'll also remember when that particular event happened now I can give you one other idea if you are making a scrapbook for a friend you make a colorful background like this and then paste a picture in between and do some creative work around the picture it will make the front page look beautiful and amazing your friend will love it so yeah my only tip here is to keep the front page simple don't overfill it and the front page should just tell about the scrapbook like this one is about goa i'm going to stick my pictures of my mom enjoying in goa so yeah when you open this scrapbook you'll able to tell that oh yes it can it is it has something to do with goa so if you are making a scrapbook for a particular event or something just do just put something on the front page that tells what it is okay now in this video we'll only discuss discuss this much i hope you liked the video if you did give this video a like share and subscribe the channel so you get more such video recommendations don't forget to press that bell icon and for more i'll see you on the next video thank you